Hello everyone, welcome back. It is your boy Smithers Boss, and today we will be carrying on with a Minecraft vehicle tutorial series. Now today I have a very, very awesome vehicle for you guys. It is a Land Rover or a Range Rover, whatever you want to call it, and it is inspired by Polly off the World of Corala server. So if I can find a Planet Minecraft link, I'll place that in my description. So if there is one, make sure to go and check it out because I'm sure you'll find some pretty awesome ideas and designs over there. So let's get started with this with a coal block. Let's just make it here and you gotta put one there, jump one, and place another one. Then jump three spaces and place another two in the exact same places. Now you're gonna go quartz slabs along here and along here, right? And then you're gonna go in and get your stone and place them all along there like that. So from the top, your car should look like that. Now on the front, you're gonna place quartz slabs there. And on the back, just these two here because there's something pretty awesome that's going to go on the back so what you're going to do is you're going to put a block there and this is where you need some description of world edit or server so you're going to place a hooper or a hopper on the back and you're going to delete that one there so this looks like an exhaust pipe and it looks friggin awesome so in order to do this you need to either halt all the server activity or slash slash fast on a bucket server and you know there is other ways of doing it but you know that's the way I've used for this sort of design and you know that's what you're gonna need to do if you want to follow it so on the top here you're gonna place free along also guys sorry I didn't mention but if you do want to do this just without you can literally just place a hooper like that or a hopper so it's absolutely fine you don't need to actually do that in the middle here we're gonna place a coal block and what we're gonna do is place trapdoor there and on them both sides and then with this, we're going to need to place that there, right? And then basically, we're going to place that there and do slash slash set glass. Oop, that was not glass. That was galas. Glass. Like that. Oh, no, we are not. Let's go slash slash undo. That was a really bad move, guys. Holy God. Whoopsie daisy. <laughs> I did not expect that to happen. So let's just get the glass and I think... We're going to have to leave that out for now. I'll sort it out in a minute. So now we're going to get our quartz and put them on each side again. Right there like that. So it's a pretty cool design, right? Now what we're going to do is place a quartz stair there. There, guys. And there. Right? So now you're going to get these and you're going to bring them up to around there. So they're level with the quartz stairs. And then bring it up with the quartz slabs once again. Now we're going to place quartz stair there. Turn it there. And then finish on top of the first wheel. And then we're going to do that and do it on the second wheel. Like that. Oh, there we go. Now along the front we're just going to have two quartz full blocks. And then in the middle an anvil. And then a long. And yeah, that's about it for them. Now we're going to go get our grey stained like glass blocks and go all the way around leaving two at the front like that. Then you're going to get the you know the grey stained glass panes and put them there for the windscreen. Or no not the windscreen sorry the uh, wing mirrors sorry. I'm not very good with cars guys so you know it's all good. Now we're going to get these the item frames and our beacons and place them there like that. Now. Then we're going to hold shift and place a sign over that. And this is going to be the grill. So you're going to hold minus, space minus, and do that until you can no longer fill any of the spaces on the sign. Now place one here. And let's just type in, I don't know. That was completely spot wrong. Land Rover 1. There we go. And yeah, that's about it for the front, guys. So now we're going to get our carpet and just our snow. And the snow is going to go there, and the carpet is going to go there, right? Now we're going to get carpet and place it all the way around. Just leaving these two back, which are going to be snow. Then we're going to get some string. Place it in there. And then we're going to re-get our carpet and fill it over the top like that. Looking pretty cool. Now we need to go in and get our buttons, wooden and stone. Place that there, sorry. Jump over and do exactly the same there. And then a wooden one goes on the front like this. Boom. 
Now the last thing to do is to get the item frames again and a full redstone block and put them there Ooh, and then fill them there like that. So actually now that tutorial is completely complete and it looks friggin awesome and it's amazing for spicing up your Minecraft cities, towns, jungles, forest, whatever and you know, whenever. So I hope you've enjoyed. Uh, if you want any ideas of vehicles, make sure to drop them in the description. I would appreciate if you want to view my Call of Duty video I put up yesterday. It's doing fairly well, and I'm actually enjoying putting up like sort of different content other than Minecraft, like Battlefield, Call of Duty, etc. Once again, thank you for watching. You guys have been awesome, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye, guys.